Good afternoon. I'm Janae Town. I'm Erin Kiernan. Thanks for being with us this Monday. WHO 13's Roger Riley found that's the case in the city of Altoona. He joins us live from there. Hi, Roger. Yeah, hi, Erin. You know, the city of Altoona is adding a splash pad here at Haynes Park, and it, will, it was, you know, set just to be ready sometime next year. Well, now the contractors are saying it will be ready to go ahead. And it'll be ready by summer. So just like this weather is helping us with our parks projects, like the splash pad here at Haynes Park, it's helping us stay on track for some of our major road construction projects. So anybody who travels to Altoona frequently or lives in Altoona is very familiar that we've got construction going on on First Avenue. And so the water will be gushing here in time for a warm summer, thanks to the warm weather now. But an even bigger concern are streets under construction, like First Avenue. It's shut down in both directions. It's the way you get from the heart of Altoona out to I-80. Now that involves a few detours, so the hope is that the road projects will be on schedule or ahead of schedule. The weather is most appreciated by construction workers. Yeah, it put us ahead of schedule quite a bit. We were expecting it to be colder out. So with the nice weather, I was able, we were able to push it to get it done sooner. They're always uh, motivated to stay on track with contracts and bids and as far as that goes. So I think we're just happy all around. From a city perspective, you know, we want to get projects done the correct way um, so that we have the best possible products for our residents here in Altoona. Well, this is the case here in one town, Altoona, you'd have to think that uh, maybe a few other projects across Iowa uh, might also be wrapping up early, don't know, but just a wild guess there. Brandon, the construction worker we interviewed, told me that you know he's really appreciative because once it turns cold, he'll still be outside doing another project, but he'll still be outside. So he really appreciates the warmth. Aaron. Yeah, no kidding. We know they all do. Roger Riley reporting live for us this afternoon. Thank you.